In this video, we will talk about the causes and effects of acid rain, and the main compounds related to this phenomenon. Acid rain can have a natural origin, mainly due to volcanic emissions, particulate matter, gases like sulfur compounds, or anthropic origin, mainly due to emissions from industries and vehicles. The atmospheric pollution caused by emissions from industries and vehicles is considered the main cause of acid rain. The burning of fuels causes the formation of oxides, mainly sulfur oxides, sulfur dioxide and sulfur trioxide, and nitrogen oxides, nitrogen monoxide, and nitrogen dioxide, which are released into the atmosphere and later react with rainwater. From the reactions of these oxides into the atmosphere, there will be the formation of acids causing acid rain. The pH of rain is normally below 7, usually around 5.6, due to the presence of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere, which reacts with water, originating carbonic acid, which is considered a weak acid. However, acid rain is considered to be rain with a pH lower than 4.5 which would be caused by the presence of other acids, such as nitric and sulfuric acids. This type of rain can cause numerous problems. It can destroy leaves and tree branches, cause chemical alteration in the soil, fish death, groundwater contamination, degradation of historical monuments, destruction of metallic structures, in addition to being related to the emergence of respiratory diseases. The first effect of this type of rain is the reduction in the ability of plants to obtain energy from photosynthesis as it causes the burning of plant leaves, producing small holes. Plants may grow slowly and will have difficulty reaching their normal size. A chemical alteration in the soil can be associated with acid rain, which can dissolve plant nutrients in the soil, carrying them away in the runoff. Another effect that can be observed is the release of aluminum and cadmium, which are toxic to plants and animals, due to the acidity of the rainwater. Aquatic life can be affected as acidic lakes can have a higher acidity than vinegar. Fish can be affected, especially more sensitive species such as trout, which can quickly disappear from a lake. There are cases of acid lakes without a single fish. Another effect of this type of rain is the occurrence of changes in the soil, which will become acidic. Contaminated soil can cause contamination of watercourses. Thus, lakes, rivers, and groundwater can be contaminated. The loss of biodiversity can occur with the increase in the acidity of waters that harm aquatic life. The degradation of historical monuments is another effect of acid rain as it can corrodes limestone, copper, and marble objects. The destruction of metallic structures by acid rain can affect bridges and buildings. Although acid rain does not directly affect man severely, prolonged inhalation of the pollutants that cause this rain can cause headache, nausea, and severe respiratory illness and is related to the emergence of respiratory diseases. The regions most affected by the acidity of the rain are the industrialized regions with the greatest flow of cars. One can mention the United States, Canada, China, India, Thailand, Japan, in addition to most European countries. If you would like to know more about acid rain or any topic related to this subject, 
Leave a comment, so we can make more videos about this.